Good morning, fans, Privateer FX. Coming at you after a long night trading, 4th of November. Uh, what a fucking mess, holy Christ. Um, market's pricing in a Trump victory here. A little bit premature for that. Uh, but the charts are destroyed, right? So, if you got long dollar max last night, that was great, uh, but it was hard to hold on to it, right? So first we traded down 2090 all the way up to 2198, uh, then back to 2035. Easily one of the hardest trading sessions I've ever been a part of. Um, we sort of remain unscathed, but we certainly didn't make a cartload of money. Um, with all that vol, it was just very, very hysterical and very confusing on a lot of levels. It's still unclear who's going to win. Obviously, we have three states, maybe four, that are still counting and up for grabs. So now we're in waiting mode. Obviously, if Biden comes back and wins, you want to sell bonds, you want to sell dollar max and sell dollars R. Uh, and if Trump now wins, I don't know what to do. Uh, it seems already priced in. It's not clear um, what that means. Bigger picture, what that means on how people are going to treat American assets. Uh, a lot of questions uh, going on here. We had ES 100-point uh, range, so we tick the low to 33.28 then we tick the high to 34.30 now we've just ticked the low to 33.18 right now we're at 33.80 this is delayed um, again not clear what to do with this if Trump wins um, even the Senate whether the Senate is flipped or not is still not clear so one thing we do know I guess is it's going to be murky um, there's going to be lawsuits. Whoever wins, there's going to be lawsuits. There's going to be delays. There's going to be all kinds of like screwy um, twos and fro's. Tough, tough to say. ZB, I guess it looked too easy, right? We were down at 170.10, uh, looked great. Now we've traded all the way back up to 175. Not often that you see a four point range, um, but it's a four point range with no clarity. Where this closes is uh, just really dependent upon how this count goes and how Biden does and how the Senate looks. So it's still unclear. Right now, the bond market has priced in a Trump victory. This is premature. Um, my only advice is just to stay nimble. You gotta cut your position sizing down a little bit. Uh, just because of the vol, right? Look at Dollar Cad. Same type of uh, crap. 131 the low. We just traded 133. Now we're back at 132.45. Um, again, we're just waiting on news to see how this is going to go. I have a feeling this is going to take a few days. So you're going to get a few days of uh, nobody knows what's going on. So lean on your technicals uh, and keep your risk in check with this kind of market. I just wonder at the bottom of my heart if um, dollar yen went up to 105.35 if during this period of like indecision or confusion that the market is going to revert to the old-fashioned um, yen as a harbor of a safe haven so how do you trade this we're thinking about getting short dollar yen if we get through 104.75 getting short again through 104.36 um, Oftentimes, when things get really, really hysterical, old patterns reassert themselves. And so we're beginning to wonder if dollar yen lower uh, is going to be the trade for today. But again, 
keep the tiller steady try and keep the boat upright upright do not capsize and then also take a step back and remember this is just one trading day uh, there's 220 every year if you've done this for 30 years um, you know it's just one trading day out of like thousands uh, in your life so step back take perspective uh, right now we're looking at dollar yen downside we'll start entering through 104.75 as far as everything else we're just waiting and we're going to try and be you know news driven trading dollar max is if biden looks like he's going to win which would take days i think pennsylvania it'll it'll, it'll take days dollar max is our horse and if trump wins so say trump takes uh, one of these up for grab states that will put him over the line 270 line uh, we just stand down we really have no idea what's gonna happen uh, to the market in general if Trump wins so if you were up all night like we were try and get some rest uh, we've got ISM services uh, and then we've got some central bank stuff and plus non farms at the end of the week so there's plenty of other opportunities to make money uh, so not much to say uh, except for stay calm. Whatever your biases are towards politics, towards the world, forget them um, and just trade the price. Good luck out there, people. Hopefully we'll have some more clarity tomorrow morning uh, and the video will be at the normal time. Anyway, take care out there and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Ciao.